Hello, I am Dr. Anurag Saxena, Senior Consultant Neurosurgeon and Spine Surgeon, Narana Super Specialty Hospital, Gurgaon. Today we are going to talk to you about anterior cervical discectomy and fusion surgery, which means surgery of slip disc in your cervical spine, which is the neck, uh, back of your neck or the upper part of your cervical uh, spine. I am going to discuss this with the help of model to make you understand better. So the disc is usually a spongy material between the two vertebral bodies of your spine if you can see, uh, focus here the, so this transparent part which is in this model is usually the disc this is a spongy material which gives the uh, spine the uh, ability to bend forward and backwards and otherwise and it acts as a shock absorber as well with time when it loses water or because of any injury or any other matter if it slips out it causes compression on the nerves which are coming out here this nerves if compressed will cause pain in the hand or sometimes weakness or numbness in your hands. In severe cases, there can be compression on the spinal cord which runs down the spinal, spinal canal and that can cause weakness not only in hands, it can cause difficulty in walking and weakness of rest of the lower body. In that case, we have to go from the front of the neck by a tiny incision which is usually done under a microscope and this disc is taken out and in place of the disc, we put a small cage with over the time uh, bone grows over it and this is called as a fusion surgery. This is a very safe surgery and it usually takes patient to be uh, stay, has to stay in the hospital for around two days or three days at the, the stretch. In some cases, we are able to put artificial disc when the disc is taken out. Artificial disc allows the patient to have same degree of motion as a not natural disc, as a normal disc will give and it is as effective as putting a fusion cage. But it has to be in certain cases only with certain selection criteria. The whole idea of this surgery is to relieve pressure from your spinal nerves or from your spinal cord and you should expect relief after this surgery within one or two days and then gradually a progressive physiotherapy and other things will make you feel much more better. Thank you.